Isn't it funny that they put prices, ammo prices more specifically, in the NRA the NRA magazine when they don't do it for their own catalogs seems pretty stupid to me but this is not what the video is about I've been just looking through this March 2013 magazine and I was thinking about the New York SAFE Act However, if you saw my other video, I mentioned I'm moving to Tennessee. It doesn't really apply to me as much. I'd say as much because I will still support, send letters to all the representatives, senators, morons in Albany. But I will be moving. And it's not even just because of gun-related gun laws. It's just everything is just a mess more taxes, everything's more expensive, the weather's shitty as all hell here. It's just, it's not that great of a place to live. So, I'm packing up my stuff and moving south. But, I would like to clarify some things with the SAFE Act that non-New Yorkers probably wouldn't understand or know, know to look for. First thing, there is a trial going on for for New York. There is a place in Buffalo that filed a lawsuit against the state of New York to repeal certain certain points of the Safe Act, not the whole thing as an entirety, but they're doing more things such as the magazine limit seven that's just beyond ridiculous I have my Glock 26 loaded up to 10 right now and we have a year I think January 15th 2014 to get rid of to get rid of or register the assault weapons and the magazines even if they are pre-banned such as before 1994 they are still illegal so nothing is grandfathered in however you can keep your 10 round magazines but you're only allowed to, allowed to load them up load them up to seven moron but one thing they might not know if you're not a New Yorker as of March 15th, which is next Friday, we are no longer to do private sales without transferring it. We don't have to pay, well, the seller, well, actually the buyer, not the seller, the buyer will not have to pay more than $10 for a transfer. So it's not like going through an FFL paying 25, 30 bucks they are making it so you only have to pay no more than ten dollars paying anything going through an FFL is stupid to begin with so I don't know why they're doing us a favor by saying oh you only have to pay up to ten bucks there are just so many stupid points of this whole safe act but in all reality, it's not that much different than the 1994, which we have been following since 1994, while other people, states only had till 2004. So since 2004, we've been still following that same guideline for the assault weapons ban. However, with the magazine limit down to seven the private sales no longer 
available without an FFL legally, of course. There are a few other things such as you'll have to get background checks on ammo, which means probably more transfer fees such as the private sales for no more than 10 bucks. But even online sales after January 15, 2014, they will no longer ship to New York state addresses. So there's more than it appears to be, but it's fairly simple, but also none of it makes sense. No gun control laws ever make sense. Personally, I don't really care. I will fight it, but I don't care what they have to say. A lot, and I'm saying almost at least 85 up to 90 percent of the of the counties in New York State have passed a law which will not comply or they will not enforce the laws of the SAFE Act. Luckily, my county was one of the one of the newer ones that were just passed. There are still a few counties out there that are not going to go against it. They are going to comply with the SAFE Act. And I feel bad for those counties, but I can't help them in other counties. I can help the state as a whole, and I can help my county, and that's about as far as my help will go. Everyone has to do their part, or you're going to lose your rights. Just like with the whole Obama thing. Everyone in the country who wants it has to do it. And if you don't do it, then I guess you don't want your safety, especially if you want the government to keep you safe. That's the last person you ever want to keep you safe is the government. Only you can protect yourself. As they always say, when seconds count or matter, the police are only minutes Anyway, thanks for watching. I forgot to add, do not comply.